Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. This is Allegro. Thank you so much for coming back to watch yet another video. And if you are new here, please take a moment to subscribe to the channel, join our growing YouTube family. And also if you like this video at the end, please do share it with your friends and give it a thumbs up. So today's topic, I just want to say to you guys, stop listening to naysayers. You know, a lot of people stop in their tracks they stop moving they stop um you know trying to grow and visualize their lives for the better because somebody along the line while they wanted to you know um grow and become the better people that they want to be they shared their dreams with somebody and somebody told them that no you can't do that you're too young you are inexperienced you are everything negative they told them and they believed it and they just stopped um and i just want to tell you that don't listen to naysayers don't listen to people that want to project their insecurities and their incapabilities on your life just because somebody didn't do it doesn't mean that you can't do it and a lot of the times you will find that the most negative people are the ones that are doing nothing with their lives the ones that feel like um just because I'm not doing X, Y, and Z. That person can't do it either, you know. Um, but the most passionate people, the most encouraging people that I've come across, I've never met a successful person that's a naysayer. Um, it doesn't matter how big of a dream it is. If I go to a successful person or a person that's just a, a mover and a shaker and a go-getter, if I go to them and I say, you know what, I want to do X, Y, and Z, and this is a huge project and it's a huge dream of mine, they will say, you know what, you got it. You got this. You know, go ahead, do it, and all the best. And they will even try and, you know, just um, lead me in the right direction. If they have a contact, if they know somebody that they feel like might be, um, helpful in any way towards this goal that i have they will share it um because they're generally just not self they're not selfish people they're not negative and they believe that dreams get bigger and bigger and bigger you know you dream big today and do big do you dream bigger tomorrow you know and you have a bigger vision and so on you're in you're out um so naysayers will always try and tell you that you are dreaming too big you are too ambitious um you who do you think you are you tell them i think i am who i am you know, I am the girl I think I am or the guy I think I am. And I know that I can do it, you know. So don't listen to people that try and project their insecurities on you. You know, someone will tell you that, oh, no, why are you taking up... Um, I don't know. I want to give you a great example. I almost said something else, but somebody will say to you, um, why do you keep going back to school? Um, there are no jobs out there. Why are you going and get the, getting this degree or your honors or your masters? Tell them because I want to, you know, just because you didn't even get a degree um, or maybe you just ended up at um, one degree or whatever it was, or perhaps you just don't believe in academics doesn't mean that I shouldn't aspire for better, you know, aspire for greater. If you want to aspire for much greater in your academic life, then do so. If it's in your entrepreneurship journey, then do so. If you want to, you know, register multiple companies and work at them and be profitable and, and have a successful business empire and grow just outside of South Africa or whatever country that you're watching this from, wherever you are based and you see yourself having multiple businesses across the globe, you know, that's your dream. That's your vision. Don't let anybody else tell you otherwise. Don't let anybody tell you that you can't do it. Of course, as somebody who is so passionate and believes and dreams so much, you also need to back it up with work you need to get up in the morning look at your vision board look at your list whether you journal it down or you you have pictures and you put them wherever you feel like i see this every day and it's a reminder of why i work so hard and why i dream as big as i dream pray over your goals dream bigger you know um don't limit yourself and definitely definitely cut out those people from your lives if you, anybody that's always going to be negative stay away from them because you don't need such people around you, you don't need people always trying to bring you down when you're trying to share something positive positive you know of course you might not even need anything in return from them all you just want is for them to listen and perhaps share a positive you know comment but instead they want to bring you down and tell you that you can't do it don't listen to those people don't surround yourself with naysayers don't surround yourself with people that are going to demotivate you people that don't believe in your dreams don't believe in your potential believe in yourself and um you know hang around people where you're like-minded you dream big together, you encourage one another, you inspire one another, and you help one another in whatever projects and whatever, you know, um, goals that you're trying to reach. Those are the people that you want to hang around, not people that, you know, um, don't believe in greater, pe people that don't believe in bigger. <laughs> my son is in the other room and i think he's trying to say hey youtube <laughs> but anyway um yeah so do not 
hang around naysayers and i will repeat this on my social medias everywhere don't hang around naysayers otherwise they're going to pull you down into their mindset into their negative mindset into their low self-esteem into their insecurities and you're going to end up being like them who's just you know somebody that doesn't dream big and doesn't think that their life is worth much more than what it is right now you know um as long as we're alive, I believe that we have potential to be greater. We have potential to grow even more. So don't limit yourself by surrounding yourselves with negative people. I hope this video encourages you um, to look around your circle um, and just um, reflect and, and look at your, your close circle of friends and the people that you follow on social media and the people that you surround yourself with in general, whether it's at work, at home, your friendships. Take a look at those, analyze those and see who's good for you and who's not good for you and do yourself a favor and cut out the ones that are not good for you thank you for watching i'll chat to you guys in the next video bye